August of 2017, seven members of the church um, went to an all-day workshop given by Sue Nelson Kibbe about breakthrough prayer. And uh, we came back and decided to start working together to try to share with everybody else how we might ask God to break through in new ways, in miraculous ways, and to create an atmosphere where we <coughs> would be alert to God moments. And where we'd be full of expectations for exciting things to come. So first came the wording of the Breakthrough Prayer, which is a type of prayer called Threshold Prayer, if you remember, because we felt that at this time, or at that time, St. Andrew was on the threshold of new possibilities. But we didn't quite know what steps to take or what direction to take, so we were praying for God's help and God's direction. In our prayer, we ask God to break through our fears, break through our inhibitions, break through our differences, and to, to just give us an open heart to be ready for new possibilities. If you remember that, um, in that threshold prayer, we ask God for His plan, not our plan. So last fall, we had five gatherings where we introduced the breakthrough prayer process and distributed to everyone the breakthrough prayer specific to St. Andrew. And I'm sure that each of you knows where your breakthrough prayer card is, either your wallet, your pocket, or some people even put it on their phone. Since that time, we've been praying some form of this prayer constantly. Um, the prayer is posted in every room of the church. We just added posters with the words of the prayer and more cards in every room in the church. Uh, some of us have prayed this prayer at 7.23 a.m. and some of us have prayed the prayer at 7.23 p.m. We've prayed it at meetings and events at the church and at Sunday worship. We've prayed this at home. We've prayed it at work. We've prayed it outside in the garden, in the car, throughout our church building. And now we're at a time when we're beginning to see some answers to our prayer. So today we're going to share and celebrate some of those breakthroughs and the God incidences that we've seen happening in the church and the ways that we felt God lead, leading us and moving with us here at St. Andrew. 